One of the most awaited diplomatic events of the year is underway in Japan. The G20 summit kicked off in Osaka today. The Indian Prime Minister is in Japan for the summit. He had a hectic day, but before we get into that, here's a primer on the event itself. The G20 summit is an annual meeting of the leaders of the world's largest and fastest growing economies, the Group of 20. It has 20 members, including 19 countries and the European Union. They represent two-thirds of the world's population and 85% of the global GDP. The G20 was founded in 1999. It held its first meeting only in the year 2008. The G20 doesn't really have any permanent staff of its own, so every year in December, a member country takes its presidency and hosts the event. This year, it was Japan's turn. The G20 played a major role after the global financial crisis of 2008 and back then the organization had turned into an emergency council. Since then, all members actively participate and engage with the G20. The world economy often dominates the conversation, but important financial, economic and diplomatic issues also prominently feature in the discussions. Leaders also hold important meetings on the sidelines. This year, trade, climate change and the America-Iran crisis is expected to dominate the discourse at G20. The summit kicked off with a strong message from the host country, Japan. Prime Minister Shinzo Abe urged all leaders to support free, fair and indiscriminate trade. The 成長を実現していくという決意を共有したいと思います。防衛政権措置の応酬はどの国の利益にもなりません。いかなる貿易上の措置もWTO協定と整合的であるべきです。現下の世界貿易をめぐる状況には深く憂慮しています。